Hi, I'm Richard Mann. You know, when it comes to long range precision rifle shooting, there's long range precision rifle shooters, and then there's serious long range precision rifle shooters. And a big difference is the kit that they have. Well, this is gunsight instructor Corey Trapp. Corey, you maybe better than anybody could talk about the ideal kit for a serious long range precision rifle shooter. Well, often during class, uh, on the very first day, I will do a gear dump where I will take my, uh, my ruck and basically lay out everything I carry and the reasons for it. So let's take a look at some of the things that you absolutely really need to have. All right, sure. Besides the rucksack to carry everything around, because let's face it, this is an equipment in intensive endeavor. Yeah. You're gonna need to have a variety of rear sandbags, right? Just one or two isn't enough. I actually carry three or even four uh, in my bag of various sizes right, for support for the rifle. You'll need some kind of multi-tool and tool kit because in the field, you're gonna constantly find yourself either needing to make adjustments or trim a bit of vegetation. It's just handy to have some kind of tools with you. You'll need a pocket weather meter. Not so much for measuring the wind itself, but for measuring the conditions that you're shooting under so that you can get the correct dope right. dialed on right. the gun. These days, almost everybody is using some kind of ballistic computer, whether it be incorporated into the weather meter or a separate handheld uh, device. Since handheld computers came out, ballistic computers are, are pretty much the thing. Makes life a lot simpler. You're gonna want some kind of pad to protect you from the ground. I carry a very simple roll-up mm -hmm. uh, pad that goes in the ruck so that in damp or snowy conditions, I'm at least protected from the ground. And you can be comfortable. I can be comfortable when I'm shooting. And then you're gonna need some observation tools. You're gonna need, uh, in this case, a combination laser rangefinder mm -hmm. and binocular for scanning and ranging targets. Um, you can use separate devices, a small pocket binocular right, and right. a smaller rangefinder, uh, but that's kind of up to you. And then what do you think maybe most uh, long range precision shooters overlook when they're putting their kit together? The single thing we have the most problem with uh, people is a spotting scope. Um, frankly, a lot of people have a spotting scope right. and it may even be very high quality, but it lacks what we consider a key feature, a reticle. The reticle should match the reticle in your rifle scope so that your spotter can call corrections to you to the immediately shooter. and precisely. In the same language, essentially. The same language so you can make that follow-up shot. Hey, Corey, those are great tips. Thanks for watching. And when are you coming to Gunsight? Gunsight Academy, originally the American Pistol Institute, was founded by former Marine Jeff Cooper in 1976. It's the oldest civilian firearms training academy in the world, with more than 50 instructors and 26 ranges covering 3,200 acres. Gunsight Academy trains thousands of civilians, law enforcement, and military personnel each year. Often called the Harvard of handguns and the Camelot of the Great Southwest, Gunsight is freedom's backbone.